friends, greetings, and welcome to the Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I am your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more knowledgeable, you are more and more in control of your body, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we are here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 27 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, rosacea, eczema, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure, because the human biological system is a healing system, it is a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing, renewing, regenerating system a miracle, it really is no miracle at all. It is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health and nutrition or prescription drugs, we are here for you and we welcome your calls at 855-660-4261. If you have questions about health, nutrition, prescription drugs, you want to get off your meds, help a loved one get off their meds, and get on a good nutritional supplement program, 855-660-4261 is your number. If you want to share a success story or contribute to the conversation, 855-660-4261. We welcome your calls. And if you want to purchase any of the products you hear us talk about on the Bright Side or advertise on the program, you can head over to my website, brightsideben.com. You can click on the uh, Join the Team link if you want to start a longevity business, or you can just pull down on the shopping cart and take a look at all the longevity products, including the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, my personal favorite longevity product, the multivitamin mineral complex powder. You add to water and drink. It tastes great. It's loaded with hard-to-absorb nutrients like vitamin A and vitamin D and E and K. It's got the B-complex, vitamin C, chromium, potassium, copper, just loaded, man. Fifty bucks a canister. What the heck are you guys waiting for if you haven't tried this stuff yet? Most folks will notice results like appetite suppression and lower blood pressure, more energy, just feeling better within one or two doses. And you can find out all about it on my website, brightsideben.com, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470, 866-735-2470. All right. We are going to finish up talking about peptides today. We've been talking about peptides for a couple of days now, a week or so. And then we're going to move on to another key category of protein, and that is enzymes, which we touched on a little bit last week. We're talking protein here. Protein is the main constituent of the body. 80% or so of the body is made up of protein. The dry weight of the body is made up of protein. Protein comes in different sizes. The tiniest little chunks of protein, which can be thought of as the building blocks of protein, are the amino acids, and we'll be talking a lot about those in the coming days. Amino acids have tremendous, tremendous medicinal value. The uh, largest proteins are called polypeptides, and they can be made up of tens of thousands of amino acids. Yesterday we told you about titan, which is the largest protein in the body. It's made up of over 30,000 amino acids. These kinds of proteins are called polypeptides, and intermediate in length are the peptides, and the peptides are very, very important as well. The peptides are active. They do lots of things in the body, a lot of immune reactions. No, all immune reactions are related to peptides. The immune system is uh, designed to spot peptides because peptides represent life forms. Peptides represent enemies. And if there's a peptide in the body or in the blood, the immune system becomes very, very active. So peptides are super-duper important. They're functional. They stimulate the immune system. Some of the more famous peptides we've talked about are oxytocin, which is the first peptide that was synthesized. Oxytocin is the cuddle peptide or the love peptide. It's a peptide that's associated with bonding, with bonding between people, bonding between moms and babies. Uh, The drug MDA or MDMA, which is known as ecstasy, is associated with oxytocin. Insulin is associated with oxytocin. Oxytocin, uh, oxytocin is, is main use is used uh, is to induce labor, uh, and that's what uh, oxytocin as a medicine is used for. And as I say, oxytocin was the first peptide that was synthesized medicinally, and that was only about 40 years ago. We've only really known about peptides since the 1970s or so. 
Other good uh, important peptides, creatine, very, very important peptide. We've talked about that in the past. Creatine is important for not just for muscle building. Bodybuilders all know about creatine, but creatine is important for brain health. It's important for skin health. It's important for heart health. It's important for older folks, even if they're not lifting weights or bodybuilding, just for building tissue. Glutathione may be the most important peptide in the body, at least for protecting the body. Uh, glutathione is our anti-cancer peptide. It's our anti-aging peptide. It's our anti-poison peptide. If you're taking prescription drugs, your glutathione levels could become depleted. It's one of the little hidden problems associated with prescription drugs is they deplete glutathione. And they deplete our body's detoxifying chemicals. or They, they impair the body's detoxifying chemistry. They drain detoxification resources. Nobody ever tells you about that when they put you on prescription drugs. Nobody ever tells you that the more prescription drugs you're taking, the more you're depleting your body's detox resources, glutathione being the major peptide involved with the detoxification system. Insulin is a peptide. Thyroid hormone is a peptide. Growth factors are peptides. And as I say earlier, the immune system runs on peptides, and peptides also turn on the immune system. They activate the immune system. Peptides are found in anything that's alive. And in nature, there's this consistent pool of peptides that are all very similar uh, similar to each other. So in nature, you have, and that includes the human body, you have, a, you have hundreds, maybe three, two, three, four hundred peptides, and they're all found everywhere. Hamburgers got the same peptides as the peptides in your body. Soy has the same peptides as peptides in your body. Peptides that are found in foods are very similar to peptides that are found in your body. Similar peptides are found in frogs and lizards and corn and wheat and thyroids. There's a standard pool of peptides, almost like an alphabet of peptides, that are found throughout nature. And this is what accounts for immune reactions, and this is what accounts for autoimmunity. The immune system, our defense system, has evolved over the course of hundreds of thousands, maybe millions of years, to recognize these peptides and to respond to these peptides. If these peptides get into the blood, the body doesn't know necessarily that these peptides are, came from something that you ate. They just, the body just thinks that these peptides are invading, that a life form has invaded, to the, uh, invaded the body. If peptides from food get into the blood, the body's defense system thinks an invasion has taken place and a jumpiness, a, a jumpiness occurs. The body will develop a, a defensive response. And here's where it gets tricky. This defensive response is intelligent. The body's immune system is intelligent. It learns to recognize things. So if it is constantly being assaulted from, say, a peptide from soy or a peptide from hamburger or a peptide from milk or a peptide from wheat and it's constantly being assaulted by this peptide that has gotten into the blood, it will begin to develop a specific response to that soy, grain, milk, cheese, whatever peptide. And this is where the problem, uh, this is where we get into problems because if it has learnt to develop, uh, to respond to a specific kind of peptide from a food, if that very same peptide is also found in your thyroid, the immune system, which has now learnt to jump on that peptide when it gets in the blood, will also jump on the thyroid. People, that is what autoimmunity is about. It is not complicated. No matter what your doctor tells you, we know what causes autoimmunity. It is a jumpiness, a learnt response of the immune system to a specific peptide in something you're putting in the body that is similar to a peptide that is already in an organ or a structure of the body. It is a learnt response to a food peptide, or usually a food, uh, pretty much only a food peptide, that is now cross-reacting with a peptide in your body, a peptide in your thyroid, a peptide in your pancreas, a peptide in your blood, a peptide in your skin. It's a cross-reactivity between a food peptide and an organ peptide. This is what autoimmune disease is. This is why when you fast, your autoimmune disease gets better. Don't take my word for it. Try it. I know there's millions of people out there with autoimmune diseases, and many of you guys and many of the people listening to this program are among those millions. Try it. Lay off a food for a day. Watch what happens. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. Got more to say here about peptides and immunity. You are listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. Our number 855-660-4261. We will be back after this.
Hello, it's Tom Chenault from the Tom Chenault Show. We are experts in home-based business and residual income. We show people how to make money from their home, either part-time or full-time. And in partnership with Genesis Communication Network, we've organized a team to fight back about people not having money, time, or health. And we need your help. What we want you to do is if you've got an interest in building an organization to fight back against people taking our money, taking our time, and taking our health, we want to talk to you. All you need to do is call this number, 855-308-8326. Again, all you want to do is call 855 308 8326. You can make a tremendous amount of money and end up fighting for a great cause. Please call us right now. Hi, this is Gary Cooper with Midas Resources Gold and Silver. Government shutdown, inept politicians, entitlements, looming Obamacare. The death of the U.S. dollar as a global reserve currency is what nobody wants to acknowledge. We have a debt bubble that cannot be paid and will eventually crash the dollar. If you're concerned about keeping your money, why not consider storing your wealth in gold and silver? Call me, Gary Cooper, at 1-800-686-2237, extension 130. Together we'll discuss your options of buying gold and silver. Again, the global elite have plans for your money, and it doesn't include you. So call me, Gary Cooper, at 1-800-686-2237, extension 130, and we'll discuss your options of buying precious metals. Also, I can send you information on how you can roll over your IRA or 401K into a precious metal IRA. Again, don't get caught with money in your account when the dollar crashes. Call me, Gary Cooper, at one 800 686 37 extension 130. To thank you for being a loyal listener, we have a limited time freebie offer for you. Claim your free heirloom tomato seeds, just pay shipping, right now at 123freeseeds.com. These aren't ordinary seeds. These are heirloom, non-genetically modified super seeds that are open pollinated and can be grown harvested, and replanted endlessly. These survival seeds are actually more valuable than gold in a crisis. Go to 123freeseeds.com and you can get an airtight storage packet of 150 super seeds free while supplies last to say thank you for being a loyal listener. First come, first served. Just cover shipping. Go to 123freeseeds.com now to see if your free heirloom seeds are still available. That's 123freeseeds.com. The National Preppers and Survivalist Expo, presented by Triton Shelter Technologies, is the only national event designated for the prepper community. October 19th and 20th at the North Atlanta Trade Center in Atlanta, Georgia. Admission is free, and the doors open at 9 a.m. Join us and learn life-saving tips that can help you and your family handle crisis situations. Special guests include Kevin O'Brien from Nat Geo's Doomsday Preppers, David Crawford, author of Lights Out, the director and cast members from the movie Lights Out Saga, and more. Special guest speakers include GCN's own Dr. Joel Wallet, along with Dr. Bones, Nurse Amy, and Tom Mark, the director of the American Preppers Network, two-time field and screen champion Chad Weatherford, along with many other leading experts from around the country. Join us for the country's largest emergency preparedness event, absolutely free, October 19th and 20th at the North Atlanta Trade Center in Atlanta, Georgia. For more information, visit NPSExpo.com. That's NPSExpo.com. America's number one source for independent talk radio for over a decade. We are the GCN Radio Network. All right, welcome back to the Bright Side Farms. This Ben here. We are here Monday through Friday, 8 to 9 Pacific and 10 to 11 Central Time and 24-7 on our archive page at brightsideben.com. We have a shopping cart up as well as a join the team link that you can click on if you want to start a longevity business and enjoy all the benefits associated with having your own business for a one-time $10 fee. You can get your products at the wholesale price. You can make some money selling longevity products and enjoy tax benefits associated with having your own business, writing off your mileage, writing off your home office, writing off stamps, writing off papers. 
And, of course, you can also help spread the word about the power and the importance of a good nutritional supplement program like the one designed by Doc Wallach and all the folks at Longevity. Speaking of Doc Wallach, I will be doing the Dead Doctors Don't Lie program today for you guys who listen in. And we'll be talking more specifically about the Longevity products as we do on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie show. And I also encourage you all to check out my blog at PharmacistBen.com. Today I wrote about uh, autoimmune diseases, uh, lupus specifically, which is a catch-all phrase for a catch-all kind of autoimmune disease that affects various parts of the body. And you can check that out at PharmacistBen.com. Hopefully that will be up later today. All right, so uh, peptides here. Uh, peptides are the cause of immune stimulation. The immune system is designed to be activated by peptides because peptides represent life. They represent life force. Peptides are how the body identifies self versus not self. This is what the immune system is about, by the way. It's about identifying self or identifying not self as opposed to self, the enemy, the outside world. Something in the outside world only gets into the inside world, the body, under controlled conditions. Unfortunately, as we break down and as our body gets sicker and sicker and as we get older and as we degenerate, holes develop in the digestive tract, things get into the body inappropriately, this activates the immune system, thus we have autoimmune diseases. If you have an immune problem of any kind, there is more than likely a peptide involved, and of course the most likely source of peptides that get into the body are foods. Any immune condition, focus first and foremost on the digestive system, especially protein digestion. Beans and veggies and grains and dairy and meat, these are all major sources of protein. Grains are especially a big-time source of problematic protein. proteins. Gluten disease is a peptide disease. Celiac disease, gluten intolerance, is a peptide problem because gluten is a peptide. Gluten is a classic example, or gluten intolerance is a classic example of an immune system disorder that is secondary to some kind of problem associated with processing foods and peptide recognition. There's other peptides in grains, too, by the way. You hear a lot about gluten. That is just one of the peptides. There's lots of peptides in grains that can be a problem. So if you say, well, I'm laying off gluten, I haven't had any gluten, but I still have problems, it's because you're reacting to other peptides. There's peptides in milk. There's peptides in eggs. It turns out that the foods with the densest amount of protein, the densest amount of peptides, and the most active amount of peptides are the most problematic of foods. Whey protein, as much as I love whey protein, and I love whey protein, that that's contains very active peptides. Same with eggs and same with dairy in general. A lot of these peptides can affect the brain. And gluten intolerance and peptide intolerance can be associated with autism and schizophrenia and psychotic behavior, even brain fog, even just forgetfulness, even just attention deficit disorder can be caused by problems with food peptides that eventually get into the blood and into the brain. That's right. When you eat a food and it's somehow that peptide, because of malabsorption or maldigestion, somehow that peptide gets into the blood, it's very easy for the next stop for that peptide to be your brain. Yes, your brain. You have a, a barrier between the blood and the brain. It's technically called the blood-brain barrier. As the brain circulates, as the blood circulates through the brain, typically things aren't going to get out of the blood and into the brain because of this wall. It's called the blood-brain barrier. But peptides do. Peptides make it through the blood-brain barrier. Peptides that you have a problem with can make it through the blood-brain barrier, can affect the brain, and cause mental problems. This, is, this peptide connection uh, between brain health and, digestive, and the digestive system is why digestive strategies work so well for brain issues, for schizophrenia, for autism, for psychotic behaviors. It's a really neat book called Enzymes for Autism by Karen DeFelice, D-E-F-E-L-I-C-E, DeFelice, where she uh, talks about something called enzyme therapy. Enzyme therapy is basically the use of digestive enzymes to break up gluten and break up casein, which is a, a peptide that's found in dairy products and, and may help improve autism symptoms. This whole idea is based on of enzyme therapy for the brain is based on something called the gut-brain connection. And the gut-brain connection is a very underappreciated, as, underappreciated aspect of psychological problems, mental and emotional disorders. It doesn't get a whole lot of press, at least in the mainstream. It sure gets a lot of pub here on the bright side. And if you've been listening to this program, it should come as no surprise to you that there's a major relationship between the gut and the brain. 
As a therapist, I cannot understand why this link between the digestive system and all health conditions is not recognized. And I know good and well that if you've been listening to this program or you've been uh, watching my YouTube videos, or you've been to my presentations, you, you may think, oh, Ben, he's a one-trick pony. Everything involves food. Everything involves the digestive system. He's always going to tell you about the digestive system. And I know I do that. But if you realize that the digestive system is the great interface between the outside world and the inside world between out there and us, it makes perfect sense. The, the outside world becomes the inside world. Out there becomes us right at the point of the digestive system. The digestive system is the bridge. It's the connecting point between out there and inside us. And if you understand this, then you understand why the digestive system is the link to all health and all lack of health. The body is a closed system for the most part. It's a circle with the outside world outside the circle and with the inside world, us, inside the circle. It's self-contained. And without being interfered with, this inside, inside the circle will perpetually run itself. It will perpetually heal itself. It will perpetually repair itself. But if the body's not healing correctly, if it's not repairing correctly, if it's not running correctly, it means only one thing. It means something has gotten into the circle. Something has gotten into the body. Something has gotten into this closed system that is interfering with the perpetual healing process, with the perpetual self-healing, self-repairing, self-running process that is the body. Now, how is it that things get into the closed circle? I know you've heard this before, I know I've said it before, but repetition is reinforcement and we learn from repetition, so please bear with me here. The only way anything can get into the circle, the circle that we call the body, is through the skin, which rarely happens, through the nose, which rarely happens, and that leaves only one place. And that's where the vast majority of your immune system is located. It's the digestive system. It's food. And by the way, it makes perfect sense that the digestive system, that the immune system will be located in the digestive system because that is the great interface between not self and self, outside and inside. Now, leaving aside immunity problems like cancer or shingles or other viruses or any of the 120 or 150 different autoimmune diseases, all of which are obviously digested in origin because health and wellness are built in any disturbance in health and wellness have to be considered as some kind of interference from the outside world, from outside the circle, and that can only be one thing, food and food processing. And there's wonderful ways that you can improve food processing. In addition to food elimination, there's wonderful ways you can improve food processing. We'll talk about that when we come back from break. I'll take your phone calls as well. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Right Side. An e-cig revolution is sweeping across the country. But is yours American-made? Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig is. Manufactured in Arkansas with 100% USA-sourced ingredients. And when you buy American, you support local jobs. Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig is top quality at an affordable price. The very principle that once drove the American economy. Get great taste with no ash, tar, or smoke. You'll be wondering why you didn't make the change to Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig a long time ago. LaSig.com has everything you need for beginners to the advanced vaping enthusiast with a wide variety of hardware and also imported e-liquid flavors as well. Plus, Lasig smokes the competition with fast, free, same-day shipping, real people customer service, and a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. Support our country and become a Vapriot at Lasig.com or call 870-525-1440. 870-525-1440. Lasig e-cigarettes for today's modern smoker. It's time for a home security quiz. What effective home security device is smaller than a coffee cup, fakes out burglars into thinking someone is home at your house while you're away, plugs into any wall outlet, is recommended by many police departments, and sells for less than $30? Yes, it's fake TV. This year, about one in every 50 U.S. homes will have a break-in, with burglars usually picking the easy target, a dark house that looks like no one is home. Fake TV is a small electronic security device 
device that makes it look like someone is home watching TV by simulating the light from a real TV. Fake TV could be the difference between coming home to a secure house or one that's been ransacked. To get your fake TV for only $29.95 with free shipping, go to faketv.com or call 1-877-5-FAKE-TV. That's 877-532-5388 or go to faketv.com. Fake TV, the burglar deterrent. We all know that Berkey Water Purification Systems are the most trusted name in water filtration. As an authorized Berkey dealer for over six years and serving thousands of satisfied customers, the Berkey Guy offers amazing specials for Berkey Water Filtration Systems. The Berkey Light Systems include a set of self-sterilizing and recleanable black purification elements that purify water by removing chlorine, pathogenic bacteria, cysts and parasites to non-detectable levels and remove harmful chemicals such as herbicides and pesticides. Order the Berkey Light System system today complete with two black Berkey elements for only $231 and the Berkey guy will ship your order free of charge. With the purchase of a Berkey light, the Berkey guy is also offering a set of fluoride and arsenic filters for only $39.99. That's over 30% off the retail price. Call the Berkey guy at 1-877-886-3653. That's 1-877-886-3653. Or order online at GoBerkey.com. That's GoBerkey.com today. And the winner of fallback pricing is you. The results are in from Freeze Dry Guy's You Be the Boss, Tell Us What You Want Us to Put on Sale campaign. After getting phone calls, emails, blog, and Facebook comments, nominating your favorite freeze-dried foods and dehydrated foods, you the people, you the bosses have spoken. We the staff at Freeze Dry Guy have listened, as we've done since 1970. So now, one item and one entire line of food are on special sale until the end of October. The entire line of popular non-GMO and gluten-free foods are 20% off. The Family First Responders Kit, loaded with delicious freeze-dried foods like hearty beef stew, lasagna, and mouth-watering strawberries, is roughly 30% off. Go to freezedryguy.com. That's freezedryguy.com to order or call 866-404-3663, 866-404-FOOD, and make your own deal. Thank you, boss. Hi, I'm Ed Krell, CEO of Destination Maternity. We proudly support the March of Dimes work to reduce the rate of premature birth. The numbers have gone down in the past five years, but still nearly half a million babies are born too soon in the United States each year. We're helping the March of Dimes fund cutting-edge research and community programs to help more moms have full-term pregnancies and healthy babies. Join us in working together for stronger, healthier babies. Visit MarchofDimes.com. That's the sound of a 44 Magnum and Trauma Max. A high-tech hybrid Kevlar bulletproof vest from InfidelBodyArmor.com will stop it and most pistol rounds. Trauma Max is a major breakthrough in pistol-rated body armor. And prices start at just $170 per insert. More protection, more stopping power, more mobility. And it weighs less than 5 pounds. Get details at InfidelBodyArmor.com. That's I-N-F-I-D-E-L BodyArmor.com. Are you tired of searching for great talk radio? Something more important. Search no more. We are the GCN Radio Network. Love this article from Medscape. Psychotropics still commonly prescribed for autism. Children with autism spectrum disorder, ASD they call it now, autism, are still commonly prescribed psychotropic medications alone and in combination despite, quote, minimal evidence, unquote, of their effectiveness. I'm not surprised. I, I, one of my first jobs when I graduated pharmacy school was working in a psychiatric hospital. And let me tell you something. Doctors who prescribe psychiatric drugs and the pharmacists, like myself, know nothing about how these things interact with each other, how these things work, or how to even use them. And if you have autism, you don't have a psychotropic drug issue, people. You more than likely have a food issue. I want to know if anybody out there has uh, kids with autism, I want to know if they've noticed any kind of links to digestive problems, if autism symptoms get worse when uh, the kids ha are eating certain foods or if there's uh, chronic diarrhea or chron chronic constipation or chronic digestive pain. If you've got a kid with autism, I'd love to hear from you. You can give us a call at 855-660-4261 and tell everyone I help people. 
help other folks, or you can just send me a letter. And I'd like to see uh, how many parents with kids who have been diagnosed as having an autistic disorder also have a digestive problem. This gut-brain connection is so vital, people. It is so underappreciated, folks, and it is where we have control and power over our own health, the health of our children, the mental health of our children, and ultimately the health of our entire society. Because when we have, when we have kids who are growing up with mental health issues, we got a societal problem in addition to having a health problem. All right, we'll continue talking about peptides tomorrow, and we'll talk, actually we'll finish talking about peptides tomorrow, and then we'll start talking about enzymes and how you can use enzymes not just for, not only just for the digestive system, but also for mental health issues, and we'll also talk about how you can use enzymes topically to give yourself own, your own spa treatment at home with nothing more than enzymes. We'll do that tomorrow, and hopefully, uh, I've been meaning to get to a couple of letters, maybe if we have a chance, we'll do that tomorrow as well. As we continue talking about anabolic bone-building nutrition on the bright side. Okay, time to hit the phones, 855-660-4261. we got a couple lines open for you. Let's go to Oklahoma and say hi to Bill. Welcome, Bill, to the bright side. What's up, buddy? Hey, good morning, Ben. Uh, good morning. Calling about my wife. Uh, she's uh, been having uh, cramps. She said it feels like men- menstrual cramps, but mm. she's had, had a hysterectomy many years ago. And so it's it's not that uh, all right. you know could we be, could be intestinal. Uh, been working on digestive problems you know with the, I mean uh, doing the digestive enzymes and the uh, with the vinegar that you know the way you suggested is uh, it helping making a difference? Uh, no. Okay. No, so here's what you need not, to do. So. Until you figure out what kind of food is doing, uh, and I'm assuming it's a stomach cramp or, or intestinal cramp, I should say. She said uh, it's real low, and, and uh, you know, she's uh, been having fairly gotta, regular bowel movements. I asked her about that. Well, now you say fairly regular. That's like being half pregnant. Yeah, that's, what's, what's fairly regular mean, you know? <laughs> I don't know. That's fairly regular I, is know, the same I, as fairly irregular, the way I look at it. Yeah, so, yeah. So that's really, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm teasing you a little bit, but that really is a very important piece of data. And that's how you want to look at these problems as data, as information, as sampling points. You want to have as many okay. sampling points, as many dots as you can. You've got to collect the dots before you can connect the dots. So you need as many dots as you can get. And I know I said this before, but okay. it's like when you're painting a picture. If you have a dot in the middle of your canvas, that doesn't tell you anything. But once you start to accumulate some dots, you can sort of see a mountain and a river and a tree, and you can start to get a sense of the landscape. And that's kind of how right. you want to look at the body. You want to have a bunch of dots. So here's what you want to do. Yeah. First and foremost, uh, have your wife fast, not eat, period, nothing. Okay. She may have a little problem with it if she's used to eating, but it's, wor- it's going to be well worth it because it's going to be some valuable information for her. If she notices that her cramps go away when she's fasting, bingo, you know you got a food problem. If she notices she still has cramps, okay. even if she's not eating, well, then she doesn't have a food problem. But I'm guessing she's going to have a food problem here. So let's continue. Let's proceed uh, as if she's has some kind of issue with food. So she fasts. Her symptoms improve. Then she starts to introduce foods in a mono-diet uh, fashion. What I mean by mono-diet means one type of food and try to pick her favorite food and try to have just a simple food. If you eat a complex food like a TV dinner or a, or a, or a Swanson's pot pie or something that's got 100 ingredients in it, you're not going to really know what's causing the problem. So you want to try to pick a food that doesn't have a lot of parts to it, maybe some egg noodles, just plain noodles or plain pasta or maybe some eggs. Or Usually it's a, it has something to do with her favorite food. So pick her favorite food and spend all day eating it. That's the fun part, okay? Until she gets the stomach okay. cramps, that's what happens. She's going to spend all day eating pasta, all day eating potatoes, just potatoes all day, or just eggs all day, or just cheese all day, or just butter all day, whatever it is, and then you see how you feel. Now, I'm guessing when she picks her favorite food and she eats it all day, she's going to probably have a, 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 a cramp or she's going to have some kind of problem. Then she's going to know she has a problem with that food, right? Then you lay off that, you, you, you scratch that off the list, that's the food she's going to stay away from. Then you do it the next day, okay? One type of food, her second favorite food, and you keep going like this until you find foods she can eat and tolerate, and you eliminate foods that she can't eat and tolerate, and then you're on the right track. Then you start throwing in, uh, if she really wants to experiment, she can start throwing in her, her, the foods she's having problems with, with digestive enzymes and apple cider vinegar, because sometimes digestive enzymes can help her process foods that she would have a problem with without the enzymes. So you keep playing around like this until you isolate the foods that are causing the problems and you isolate the foods that don't cause problems, and then obviously you stay away from the problem foods, 
and then you uh, stick with the foods you can tolerate. Now, there's also wonderful soothing foods for the digestive system, and those are always helpful. Uh, uh, things, uh, foods that have long-chain sugars, they're called polysaccharides, aloe, noni, ocean vegetation, seaweed, the Z-radical from Longevity. These can all have a nice coating and soothing property for the digestive system. Uh, cartilage contains these polysaccharides, so bone soup and fish soup. And, uh, and now that Thanksgiving's coming up, save your, you guys, save your, tur- your turkey carcasses. They make, it makes great bone soup. Uh, and uh, subsisting as much as you can on that kind of food will, will also be very helpful. Of course, using probiotics, digestive enzymes, uh, glutamine powder perhaps, those can all be very helpful for the digestive tract as well. Does that make sense, Bill? Uh, it does. And, and, and uh, you know, bone soup we had just the other night. Did she do okay with it? She still had the, yeah, still uh, had the. Still uh, had the problem. But she uh, didn't just have bone soup. She probably put something in the bone soup or she had something with the bone soup. Oh, she had, yeah, there was a lot in it, you know. Well, you got to vegetables. Could, vegetables can easily cause stomach cramps or intestinal cramps. Uh-huh. Easily, easily. This is one of the yeah. one. You know, everybody thinks, well, I just eat spinach or I just have veg- vegetables. I'm a vegan. I'm a vegetarian. People don't realize that vegetables contain substances that are toxic, especially these okay. things called lectins. So you can have reactions to vegetables easily, 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 easily. So you just got to, okay. you know, it's a game. It's not a maybe not a pleasant game, but it's a game. It's a detective okay. game. You've got to be Sherlock Holmes of the digestive system. Okay? Just so focus. If, if she could fast uh, completely with, I mean, we supplement quite a bit with vitamins and Stay and off everything. For two days, stay off everything. 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 Stay everything. Clear out the system. It, Clear the decks. Hit the reset button. Okay. All right? And okay. then start from scratch. Go back to baseline. Okay. Start from scratch. It'll be well worth it. All right, Bill? Okay. Stay in touch. I'd like to hear, what you, right. I'd like to hear what, you, uh, what you find out. Either shoot me an email or call us back. I'd like to hear... Uh, how you doing? Okay, Bill? Okay, thank you. Thank you so much, buddy. God bless. Have a beautiful day. All right, Ryan in Texas. Uh, let's see, we've got about a minute before we got to go to... Oh, that's our break. Ryan, hang tight. We'll get you when we come back, okay? I'm sorry. Uh, i got to put you back on hold, and we'll try to get to all our callers today. Colleen, Peggy, Chuck, hang on. You're listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. I am Pharmacist Ben. We will be back right after this. have all seen and heard about the elements of the periodic table. These elements are the building blocks of everything in the universe. You, my friends, are made from these elements. A shortage of any of these important trace elements can lead to disease. Go with the science and take the Lady Talk Health Challenge and get all 90 essential trace elements with a healthy start pack at LadyTalkLive.com or call 855-333-LADY. That's 855-333-5239. Research shows it's not just what you put in your body that counts, it's what you put on it as well. Why not use an all-natural, healthy, mineral-based makeup that actually benefits your skin? Once you experience the airiness and flawless coverage of Longevity Mineral Makeup, you will never use anything else. With Longevity, the perception of your complexion will be natural perfection. Animal-friendly mineral makeup at Mary Lou Health. That's M-A-R-I-L-U Health dot com. Or call 855-321-HEALTH. This alert just came in. This special announcement is for business owners and leaders of organizations who've been waiting for the right time to build. General Steel has made it impossible to wait any longer with rock-bottom prices that could save you thousands. That's right. General Steel, America's leader in pre-engineered structures, is offering buildings at prices you will never see again. Don't miss these specials. A 14 by 21 foot shop for under 6000 or a 50 by 100 for under 30000 You heard right. That's 5000 square feet under $30,000. Manufacturers, if you need a larger building, try a 100 by 100 commercial building for $129,000. You can't afford to rent with these prices. Imagine a 70 by 100 foot church building for under $69,000. With the economy improving and interest rates still at historic lows, you can't afford to wait. So call 866-91-STEEL. 866-91-STEEL. That's 866-917-8335. 
Hello, I'm Steve Shank. Everybody's heard the statement that what you don't know can't hurt you. But truth is, what you don't know is the only thing that can hurt you. For example, you might not know how our country's wars can hurt you. Japanese radiation and the Gulf oil spill are destroying your seafood. People don't understand how America's 50-year worst drought is hurting them. Our natural disaster experience has proven relief organizations can't take care of the victims. And there's the huge question of how the government will feed all the people that it's promised to feed with no food. What if we made the whole country into one big neighborhood where we take care of each other by taking care of ourselves? Here's the plan. For every new EPAC 60-day food supply that you order, eFoods Direct will send a 7-day food supply to each of two families in your name, free of charge. Go to eFoodsDirect.com or call 800-876-0871. 800-876-0871. eFoodsDirect.com. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy viruses products from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a Big Berkey at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey Water Filters, for the love of clean water. The GCN Radio Network, providing the world with hard-hitting talk radio. GCN. Great talk radio starts here. All right, we're back on the bright side. Ryan in Texas, what's going on? Ryan, do we have Ryan? Ryan, Ryan, going once, going twice, going three times. I guess Ryan dropped off. So... We will move on to Canada and talk to Colleen. What's up, Colleen? Oh, good morning, uh, Ben. Um, we've been, my husband and I have been uh, doing uh, the longevity products for a couple of years, but we're not very consistent at it. Okay. But we noticed my uh, husband, when we do the uh, tangy tangerine, he gets uh, diarrhea. Oh, yes. And it just goes right through him. Oh, and yeah. for me, it makes me nauseous. Okay. And neither one of us can stand the taste of it. Wow, so man, you hurt my feelings another, here. Oh, I'm, I'm getting crushed. I'm sorry. Oh, my God, <laughs> I don't mean to, um, to be negative. Right. I'm just kidding. You know, I but can, we've we can spent, help you. spent a lot of money on it. Okay, and, you want to make um, it work, right? It, exactly. I, I want to place another order, but I want right. to do it right. Okay. So we're both 52. Okay. We both suffer from, you know, the usual... 52 no. symptoms of No, don't say that. Don't. There's no usual. Yes, I hate I'm, to say it because... They're not usual. <laughs> well, tell me your symptoms. Tell me a couple of your symptoms. Well, it's, well, it's nothing serious. We don't have high blood pressure or any of that stuff for diabetes. But it's just, you know, we're starting to feel the age thing. Okay. And um, my husband especially, he's had arthritis all of his life. From okay. the time he was just a little boy. Okay. And he's also got, suffers with irritable bowel syndrome. I oh, believe well, that's hello. what it is. And you're wondering why the non tangy tangerine goes right through them? Here's the scoop. First of all, arthritis. Okay. Okay. Arthritis from a, uh, when you have juvenile arthritis, which it sounds like he's been dealing with, and then it progresses into adult arthritis, you have a classic, classic, classic autoimmune disease. That's what juvenile arthritis okay. is. JRA, they call it, juvenile okay. rheumatoid arthritis. It's an autoimmune disease. And if you've been listening to the program, you know, I've, t- uh, there's a, I've been just saying this almost every day for the last week, for the last couple of years, for the, my entire professional life, pretty much. Autoimmune diseases go hand in hand with digestive problems. It is not surprising that if he has IBS, irritable bowel syndrome, and, and JRA, and, and, and I don't mean to scare you, but he probably has a lot more things going on than that. Uh, it's not surprising that the BTT would go right through him. The Beyond Tangy Tangerine, okay. by the way, is it, two, is it the new one or is it the, re- not that it makes a difference, just curious. Is it the 2.0 or the? It's the, the older one. Okay. The Beyond Tangy Tangerine is packed with nutrients, especially minerals. That's, it's packed with a lot of things, but especially minerals. Minerals absorb water. All right? You know how they put salt on the, on the road up there in Canada? Where in Canada are you, by the way? Yeah. 
Where are you? Sure, yeah. Where are you in Canada? British Columbia. Okay. So you know how they put yeah. salt in the roads to, to suck the water up, to, to dissolve the ice uh, in the wintertime? Yeah. That's because there's a very interesting chemical reaction that happens between minerals and water. In chemistry, we say minerals are hygroscopic. That means they absorb water. As you eat your, or when you drink your Beyond Tang Tangerine, or you put minerals in your body, those minerals pass through your stomach. They go into your intestine. Now, if you're healthy, at that point, those minerals get absorbed into the blood through the intestine. That's where it occurs. But if you're not healthy, if you've got a broken down digestive system, you may not absorb those minerals. IBS is, by definition, a broken down digestive system, intestinal uh, I guess is a irritable bowel disease, the bowel is the intestine. So you've got some kind of problem going on in the intestines. That means the minerals are going to pass through the small intestine and they're going to go through the large intestine and they're going to ultimately be dumped out of the body. Number one, that means you're not getting your minerals. Big problem. Great. Big, big problem. Yeah. Because it means that you're already, you're already sick now. You've already got a problem. You've got a health issue. Now it's going to get worse. And this is where this degenerative, yeah. vicious downward spiral occurs. You got a broken down digestive system. You don't absorb nutrients. You get a further broken down digestive system. You get a further malabsorption, further breakdown, further malabsorption. On and on and on this goes until we fall apart. That's why you're 52 and you say, "Well, I'm falling apart," but you shouldn't be falling apart. 52 is young, believe it or not. You still got half your life. You, you still got another half to your life. You're you're only halfway through. So uh, the minerals pass through the small intestine to go into the large intestine because they absorb water. You end up with diarrhea and loose stools. That's what happens when people take the BTT and they're not absorbing their minerals. This is very, very, okay. very common. But it's also good news okay. because now you have a barometer. Now you have a diagnostic right. measurement. You can tell when you're absorbing. So if you take your Beyond Tangy right. Tangerine, you have diarrhea, you have malabsorption. But if you do a few things, which I'll tell you what to do here in a minute, and you don't have diarrhea, bingo, you know you've improved your health. Just by that. You don't need okay. a doctor. You can do it yourself. Well, so how do you do it? It, well, seems to come up, it seems to come up mostly with stress. He seems to be okay, well, and then as soon as he gets stressed I out, I can't help bam. you with stress, but stress will further compromise no. the digestive system. Okay. All right, give him a okay. back rub. Give him a massage. You know, <laughs> that's what you, Relax your husband. There's all kinds of things wives can do to relax their husband, if you know what I mean. So take care of your husband there and relax his stress. Okay, anyway. Here's what you need to do for malabsorption. I'm talking to everybody out there who's experienced this, a diarrhea or loose stools from the BTT. Start to acidify the digestive contents. The most important, there's a lot of reasons, but the most important reason why we deal with malabsorption is lack of stomach acid. So start to work on acidification of the stomach contents with food. Now, there's a bunch of ways to do it. Betaine HCL is the classic way, B-E-T-A-I-N-E. -E. You can buy that at a health food store. Of course, you're going to get some betaine HCL on the ultimate enzymes, and then you'll get the benefits of the enzymes as well. So you want to use the ultimate enzymes or any other source of betaine. You can also use apple cider vinegar to acidify the contents of the food. And you can also use um, uh, HCL drops. I'm not sure what the standard is in Canada for HCL drops. Here in, this, in the States, you need to get a prescription for it. Whatever HCL drops. I'd be, that's what I'd be doing, by the way, because it sounds like your husband's got a severe case. Make sure he's using digestive enzymes as well. And you can also use something called pancreatin. P-A-N-C-R-E-A-T-I-N, which is pancreatic ex uh, pancreas extract, which can also help with mineral absorption. Also using smaller doses of the Beyond Tangy Tangerine can help. Sipping on it all day long can be helpful. That way you don't give the body a big load of minerals that it has to absorb right away, and that might help you with the taste of it. Uh, put, put your BTT... Uh, no, the taste sucks. <laughs> No, it doesn't yeah, suck. It's delicious. Taste. It's delicious. It's horrible. Don't <laughs> they have something else? Like what's you, that berry no, blend that no. Alex Jones talks about? Hang on. Uh, what's the me. Mighty 90? Colleen, you're not listening. Hang on. Hang on. Sorry. I've tried it for two years, and it tastes as bad as How much are you doing? Years ago. What's the big dose? What's I, do the dose? My, I do my two scoops. I no. do my two scoops and my Colleen, eight ounces you gotta, of you gotta water. Colleen, you've got to put your listening hat on because you're not listening. Smaller doses, not two scoops, okay. not two scoops, a teaspoon okay. in water. Do a teaspoon of water okay. and do it more frequently, and also for your husband as well. 
The most important point, and I got to move on, Colleen. The most important point is you want to do smaller doses, and you want to regard his diarrhea as malabsorption, which is extremely significant because it's going to age him faster, and it's going to result in more degeneration and ultimately uh, an early demise. And, and there's all kinds of ways, uh, all kinds of horrible diseases that can precede an early demise that you don't want to get. The fact that he has arthro has had arthritis his whole life tells me that he's probably had digestive problems his whole life as well. And that is not a good thing because it, it, it's a sign that he's going to be degenerating rapidly. Focus on food allergies, focus on digestive nutrients, and use smaller doses of the BTT. And I would encourage you both to stay on it because it's an absolutely wonderful, powerful, and very effective nutritional supplement. Thanks so much for your call, Colleen. Appreciate it. Chuck in Texas got about a minute and a half. Love to help you out. What's going on, buddy? Uh, hi, I'm 67. Okay. I have a cataract in the left eye. Okay. And, and other health problems. Well. And I've been recommended to do the surgery. Okay. I what was your... Okay, here's my take on here's my take on cataracts. Cataracts are a cloudiness or a, a breakdown of the lens of the eye. It's just a sign that the body's breaking down. The fact that it's breaking down in the lens doesn't mean anything as far as the reversal or the healing process takes, uh, as far as taking advantage of the healing process or, or the body's renewing systems. It doesn't matter where the breakdown occurs. Now, you say you don't have any other health conditions. That's not true, Chuck. There's no way that the cataract that you're, uh, you only have a cloudiness in the lens of the eye. It doesn't work that way in the body. The body breaks down as a system. The cataracts are what you notice, but the body's breaking down in general. So here's what you're going to need to do. Number one, you're going to, as always, focus on the digestive system. As long as stuff is getting into the body, into the body proper from the digestive system into the blood and into the system, it's going to be very, very difficult to reverse the cataract. So you need to patch that digestive system up. If you don't know that you have any digestive health issues, and it sounds like you don't, that's, that's, uh, you're missing some important information. Uh, pay attention to your bowel movements. Pay attention to cramping. Here's the thing about the digestive system. If we've had digestive problems our whole life, and many of us have, we're not going to notice them necessarily because the brain only notices surprises. It only notices things that happen unusually. If you have a problem that's been going on your whole life, you may not notice it. Until you patch that up, you're going to continuously, you're going to, you're going to continue to break down. Uh, uh, so patch up the digestive system. Make sure you're using all the digestive supplements. And as far as Rebuilding the lens of the eye and other tissues of the body. There's tons of nutrients. Protein is very important. Vitamin C is very important. Make sure you're on the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. Vitamin E can be very, very helpful for the eyes as well as for general building, as can zinc, as can selenium. So many things, man. Chuck, if you call back tomorrow, I'll take you first up and we'll, uh, we'll help you out in more detail. Thanks so much for your call. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You, uh, you've been listening to Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. We will be back with more good health information tomorrow. Have yourselves a wonderful, beautiful day. We'll talk to you all later. Bye. So, you've decided to get prepared. You're not sure that a case of ramen and a couple of granola bars under your bed will cut it as long-term food storage anymore. You're in luck. At Emergency Essentials, we have all the resources to get you started, from three-day emergency bug-out bags to year supplies of food and everything in between. Call Emergency Essentials at 800-999-1863 or visit BePrepared.com. The choice is clear. Be unprepared or BePrepared.com. Are you someone who forges your own trail? Are you a pioneer with the need to homestead your self-reliant entrepreneur spirit? If so, RF Bunker has a franchise opportunity for you. RF Bunker is the fastest growing emergency and survival retail store in the United States. RF Bunker franchise opportunities are leading the way for business-minded heroes seeking adventure in owning and operating their own emergency supply and survival store. Visit rfbunker.com or call 866-623-2932. This offer is not being directed to any resident of the register-required states. Time and time again. You need to come here and help us. We need assistance. Please. Those we should be able to depend on let us down. Federal and state and local officials saying help is on the way. Well, the folks here in Bell Harbor say show me. Don't depend on the government to save you. Take action now so that you're prepared for the next disaster with MyPatriotSupply.com. Get the best prices on storable food, non-GMO seeds, water filtration devices, home canning equipment, survival and self
self-reliance books, and more at MyPatriotSupply.com. Call 866-229-0927. We are hurting down here, and we need help immediately. Before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotSupply.com. MyPatriotSupply.com. 